The third category is that of political will, and that is a potential rivalry with China harboring long-term designs to rewrite the existing global order. The Ming Dynasty appears to be their model, albeit in a more muscular manner, demanding other nations become tribute states kowtowing to Beijing, espousing one belt, one road, when this diverse world has many belts and many roads, and attempting to replicate on the international stage their authoritarian domestic model, militarizing South China Sea features while using predatory economics of piling massive debt on others. After World War II, our greatest generation, in collaboration with our allies and partners, built the open international order that has benefited global prosperity. It's unrealistic to believe today that China will not seek to replicate its internal authoritarian model elsewhere as it expands globally. China has benefited enormously from the open international order, <clears throat> but it had no say in drafting it. Today, how we engage with China and how the Chinese choose to collaborate vice dictate to the world will provide the roadmap for our future relationship.